In our never-ending arguments over bike lanes, a few questions usually arise, and a new study from the London School of Economics addresses two of those questions. Number one, do bike lanes actually get more people to ride? And number two, how much do bike lanes disrupt motor vehicle traffic? The study looked at the rollout of London cycling superhighways between 2014 and 2019. It found in the first year, the number of cyclists on those routes increased by 25%, and that increased by 20% further every year after that. And it did not find a significant disruption in cycling flow on neighboring streets, meaning it wasn't siphoning traffic away from those streets, meaning these were most likely new cyclists, not just moving cyclists around. Interestingly, the number of accidents involving cyclists on these streets also decreased. As for that second question about how much these bike lanes disrupted the flow of motor vehicle traffic, here's what the author wrote. Similarly to other studies on cycle lanes, I did not find any impact on car traffic. There you go.